All right, hey everybody, welcome back to some more uh, dark wood. We're just gonna get right into it, I think. Uh, we do have the problem of that we died last time to uh, wildlife, but I think we're just gonna go on nightmare again because, I mean, otherwise I'm a quitter, and I'm not. I can't live with that. I guess maybe I'll try Indiegogo stuff this time. I'm still afraid it's gonna be just like OC character do not steal sort of shit that people paid for to get into the game, but I don't know. It, it could be interesting. Maybe it'll... Oh, oops. Press back. Maybe it'll be something that, uh... helps. Maybe it'll make things easier. Oh, the game doesn't like that, though. Oh, there it goes. Yep, I know. Challenging and unforgiving game. Right. Yeah, I was considering going on the difficulty below Nightmare because they say that it's, um, what is it? It's not like super easy or anything. You still have like a limited number of lives instead of just one life and you can get more lives, which sounds all right. I might do that in the future if, uh, if we end up dying again really quick on Nightmare. But uh, I don't really mind playing through the beginning of the game again. I mean, luckily we get to skip the prologue because the prologue was just, um, it'd, it'd be pretty boring doing that again. And I didn't even like it too much the first time. It was just, it really held your hand. Uh, so at least we get to skip that. And yeah, I don't r mind doing some of this beginning stuff again because uh, apparently there's a lot of different things you can do, or at least a couple, that can change like outcomes and stuff like that. Um, different different ways of approaching things even very early on and stuff we might have missed and uh, I'm trying to avoid spoilers like I haven't really been reading any spoilers or anything but there was a, a couple of things did I not skip the prologue? okay can we remedy this? <laughs> alright yeah yeah oh you press escape it just what is this? Weird. I'm in the game, I'm out of the game. In the game, out of the game. Uh, oh, this is the pause menu. It just looks identical to the to the main menu. I see. Yeah, well, let's just... Uh, second try. Try this again. Play. Skip prologue, yes. I don't know why that wouldn't just be on. I mean, uh, who's going to... Who's going to watch the prologue again? It wasn't that great. Okay, oh, yeah. Now I get the loading again. Good. Yeah, but uh, anyway, I'd be up for trying the the uh, easier difficulty if we have to. But the thing is, this is a horror game, and horror games don't do much for me anyway. I mean, like, I like horror games a lot. They just don't scare me much, um, unless they're, like, amazing. But even then, it's it's pretty rare. But that's the thing, is this game, one thing it has going for it as far as, like, a, a scare factor, a fear factor, is that there's consequences. If you die... You got to start over. You got to do all that stuff over again. That's that's like a real consequence. It's you know, obviously it's a video game, so you can't you can't have it to where like you die in real life or something. You can't have like real fear, but you can get close when losing time. Time is valuable, so I want to have the you know consequences so that uh, my decisions matter, and so that it does sort of simulate fear in a way. Um, okay, so we've done this all before. We we have some some things we've learned. One is to uh, stop walking on bear traps. Um, yep, take all these. We've got the mushroom book. Someone told me that this was uh, Polish. Uh, makes sense. I don't know if that has anything to do with it. Um, but they were saying the uh, the Polish mixed with the date we saw before, which was like eighty three or something. It, it shows in the prologue, but you know we skipped the prologue this time. Um, it's apparently I'm since we've already seen this I'm just going by it if if you didn't see the first one it's not important stuff it's just saying this gas keeps keep stuff away so keep the gas going and they got an oven to cook things in and he wants to cook mushrooms so we're going to do that eventually uh, yeah yeah red pulsating mushrooms they look tasty yeah and that's how you level up but we don't have any yet and I wouldn't be surprised games like this it usually seems this kind of thing might be one of those dual-edged swords sort of things where, like, uh, you use the mushrooms to level up, but maybe if you don't eat them, 
you get like a different ending or you get some special items or something. I gotta remember how you, uh, what was it? You hold right click? No, you hold left click? You hold left click. Okay. What was I talking about before that? I don't remember. <laughs> something about the difficulty or, uh, I'm just all over the place is the problem. Yeah, I gotta remember all the controls. Barricade one of the windows. I want it. You know, we did actually surprisingly well last time barricading basically nothing. Um, nothing we can make yet. So I guess first thing we want to do oh, is get some mushrooms. Yeah, definitely want those. And then still never use the saw. I guess we'll want to head over to the underground. Well, I guess I guess we need gas. And we found gas over yeah, over to the west. Can we pick up these mushrooms? I don't understand why one time it seemed like I could pick them up and now every time since then I I can't. But whatever. Okay, corpse night. Oh, this is that corpse I kept looking for and I could never find. Sweet, except I dropped the gas. There it is. Oh, I don't mind nonsense. Don't worry about it. Yeah. <laughs> Need something. Uh, it's good background, you know. Location found brook. Okay. Yeah, I'm happy I found that corpse. That'll make things easier. More gas. Am I? Uh, I should probably look at the map here. Wait a minute. This isn't the same map. <laughs> Does it? Is it rant? I didn't know it was random. The map is randomly generated? I mean, it's still... There's still the Silent Forest, Old Woods, Dry Meadow. I mean, those are the same three places, but last time, this was over here. The woods were down here. Huh. And yet the corpse was still directly west from the house, in the same place. That's kind of strange. The corpse with the gas. Okay, I guess that's another reason why playing it through again isn't, uh, isn't so bad. We get new stuff. Oh yeah, and here's the farm over here. Seems a lot closer. Hmm. Like I said, I have been trying to avoid spoilers, but that is one thing I heard about, is that there's something that goes on over here, but you need like a... an invitation or something? I think that's where it happens. But like... Oh, what is... what is that? What was that? <laughs> Looked like a giant beetle. I, I, well, I need to go this way anyway, so I guess I'll chase after it. Yeah, more poisonous mushrooms I can't pick up. Did I pass? Oh, yeah, there it is. Oh, it's a rat. I see. Bunch of rats. Oh, I remember what I was talking about before that I forgot. The guy, yeah, he said that that was written in Polish, and that mixed... Oh, here's the underground. That mixed with the date, that was like 83 or something, means that it would have taken place during the time... This game, I guess, takes place during the time when Poland was under communist rule. So, I don't know, maybe that'll have some sort of... Some sort of... Oh, jeez. Some sort of impact. Uh, these bear traps. Okay, note to self, be very careful when walking through doors. Hopefully there's something in here that's worth it. Uh, bread's alright, I guess. At least it wasn't like one of them that I put down myself because that's the worst. Um, how do you... is it E? Yes. Right, I'm remembering. Already out of space. Um, unless we want to, yeah, start putting stuff in our inventory like... Hmm. Oh, let's make the rags into a bandage and then keep those bandages on hand. Or actually, let's make an alcohol bandage because we got two alcohol. And then let's use it because we did, well, you know, we're not that low on health. We'll, we'll save it, because I'm not sure how much it actually uses up. Um, and I guess we'll stick the gasoline here just to make more room. And I think that's, yeah, that's everything there. There's a wardrobe. More gas. Okay, nice. Um, matchsticks. This is one of those items that just disappears. And I guess the entire point of these items that just shows you a picture and then disappears is so that you can show them to other players later on. I mean, other players. It's not a multiplayer game. Other other characters. NPCs. Um, now, when I went down under there last time... Oh, right. you got to move the dresser to get down here. When I went down here last time, the only thing that seemed to have happen, happened was I just... I found the exit, 
which seems to be like the exit for like the whole game. Like how you get out of this, how you beat the game. Oh, well, I'm happy I got through here to get these mushrooms, if nothing else. Uh, I found it, but there, I couldn't actually go through it, obviously. You know, it's not going to let you beat the game just right away. But it also, um, there was like not really anything down there. You know, maybe let's... I'm going to head back to camp. I'm going to drop this stuff off. And then go for another exploration. We'll kind of decide where we're going from there. Oh, you know what? Let's, uh, let's disarm this. Will this let me take the bear trap or will it just be a scrap again? Yeah, just scrap. Okay. Still useful. I mean, it's not doing me any good sitting out there. But yeah, last, when I went underground, it, it, uh, I don't think I actually got anything important. Maybe there was a bit of junk I picked up, so I might just hold off on that and not run away from, uh, that, that thing again. Right, I'll need to, I'll come back to this guy. That torch would be nice. Especially if I change my mind and decide to go into the underground. Hmm. Still don't know what that's for, or what the combination is. Alright, yeah, let's store some stuff we don't need. Oh, antidote. Oh, you can turn the mushrooms into antidotes. That's kind of interesting, because that means if my theory is right, that using the mushrooms might have some sort of ill effect, um, because that's what these kind of games do, you know? Uh, if that's the case, then there's still something you can do with them, which is cool. That's a nice little consideration. Let's make a chain trap. Um, and let's, yeah, let's store that there. Let's store this other scrap metal here. Let's store the bullet, because I don't have a gun, so it's pretty worthless to me now. Let's, let's store the gas. Um, the pill, I think, is just for selling, as far as I can tell, so we'll keep that. Don't need a battery, because we don't have a flashlight. Um, the rest of the stuff is kind of, I don't know. Lockpicks would definitely be useful. Bread could be... Matches, I doubt it, but I don't know. Rope, uh, could be. I'm, I guess we'll keep the rest of it. It doesn't leave us a ton of room, but more than... Ah, we don't need matches. Okay, good enough. Now let's head back out. Um, we could check out up here. And, you know, we might as well do that. Just get the outskirts sort of uh, explored. And there's a road going up here, too. Although it kind of leads that way. Oh, and yeah, look, get some scrap. Yeah, I think there's probably bound to be something up here, and I guess that's the thing, is since the game is somewhat randomly generated, or probably procedurally generated, I guess is more accurate, uh, it actually does make sense to explore around here, because I, I don't know what's here. Which is nice. I, that actually makes replaying it, you know, that that kind of tips me in the in the direction of doing Nightmare again, even if even if I died again, like, really quick. Because why not? It'd be different stuff again. And then it'll be like, you know, when you're playing Mario or something, you just get better every time. Okay, corpse, more gas. Oh, we are doing good on gas this time. Wire and rags. The rags, we can make another bandage. This is already going so much better. Let's, uh, let's use this one. We're not going to use alcohol with it, because I don't think we need it. And let's see how much that does. We do need to... I need to get a general idea of how many, how much these bandages heal, so that I'm not wasting them. If this heals all the way... Yeah, it did, and there's still some left over. There's still a lot left over. Okay, so it looks like a normal bandage is enough to... maybe heal you all the way? So maybe a bandage with alcohol just heals you faster? I don't know what that scribbly line is there. Or why the broken tree shows up on the map, but... These ambient noises are kind of, uh, worrying. What is this? It sounded like someone's singing or something. Open it with a lockpick. Uh, yes, please. Oh, wait, yeah. With a lockpick, you just hold down. Oh, man! Bear trap. More gas. Uh... Matches, nine, well, scrap we can pick, we can stack. I guess we'll take those, and that'll just take up all of our inventory. This is really good, though. We're getting some good supplies this time. Should actually be able to make something of this run. Not die to a deer. It's also something I should have kept in mind, is that it's probably smarter to run away from enemies most of the time. I mean, this is a horror game. Uh, 
you're probably not supposed to fight everything. Another crate. We are doing really good with this loot. Oh, right. Uh, I keep thinking I need to get the uh, lockpick out. Pills. Flare, matchstick. Well, we can stack these. Take the pills. Flares are pretty useful. Um, but we'd have to get rid of something. Right, let's get another scrap stacked. And I guess head back to drop off more stuff. Yeah, I guess so. We're just loading up here. I wonder if these rats actually are do anything. Could we catch them? Could we eat them? Okay. All right. Dog nearby. Very close. That is that is very close to camp for there to be a dog. So yeah, I'll need to watch for that. hear it or I can hear something I don't think I'm paused when I'm in this menu either so this is oh yeah yeah let's cook the mushrooms before they go bad yeah we don't have enough to level up or anything but we do want to cook those I think there's some mushrooms yeah there's some right there that I missed you know did I actually look inside here I didn't rag photo over road right close and a bunch of nails, which is good. If we can get some nails and some boards, we can board this place up. Which we didn't do last time, like I said, and it wasn't really, it didn't seem to be that big of a deal, but um, I think that's also partially random. Is, uh, is how much, like what comes and attacks you and stuff like that. Uh, we, uh, bread I guess we'll keep on us, pills we don't need, bear trap we don't need, wire we probably don't need, and nails we don't need, because I don't think we'll need to board something up, like, you know, out in the middle of nowhere. Oh yeah, first time, uh, first time catching the stream, that's, that's not surprising, because I don't think anyone caught it last time, because, uh, I was an idiot and didn't put like the information in the description so like it was listed as me playing um, no game at all and it was like with no description there it was just unlisted so only like my friend of mine was able to find it even so yeah I've fixed that hmm Do I want to fill up the gas now? I, I can just do that later. We've got enough gas, I guess, anyway. Right, you can bolt over stuff. Um, so what are we looking for now? Wood and a weapon, I guess. Okay, there's the dog. Okay. Um, I'm not sure if running is going to attract him more than... It doesn't seem to. All right, but yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna avoid him. And yeah, we want to go back to that where we were because there was one other thing in the uh, in that crate, if I remember. There we go. Yep. Flares. Yeah, those are pretty useful. In fact, since we don't really have any that much useful stuff on us, we might as well keep those there. I don't want to accidentally use them, but. They are pretty pretty useful when you can just throw one down and uh, then, you know, if it's nighttime, you throw one down and then you can fight something or you can see what you're doing if you don't have lights. If you're a, a dummy like me and you forget to uh, put gasoline in the generator or something. Okay, another dog. Doesn't seem to have noticed us, so just go around. I do kind of want to check out what's through the, like along that road, though. Okay, corpse. Oh, this is more of that farm. Interesting. Alcohol's good. Nine volt is good. Yeah, wait, wait a minute. This is just a different farm? Not the, uh, not the one with, like, the flowers? The creepy flowers outside? It's just some other farm? Is there even... I don't even think there are any buildings nearby. It's just a, a maze that I'm getting sucked into now. 
probably should have just stayed away. I, okay, I thought this would be very easy to uh, get through because last time it was. Uh, okay. Yeah, you know what? I'm just going to go back the way I came before I get lost. Also, the sun's setting, I think. Either that or it's just dark in here. Yeah, yeah, the sun is setting. Um, well, gonna look around a tiny bit more. Just, yeah, I want to see what's around this. More gas. Okay, sweet. Oh, and a crate. This is like, okay. Do I have a lockpick? I don't. And to make one, I need two wire. Okay. Okay, so wire is actually useful for something. I didn't remember what, what it was. I th thought it was something. But yeah. Alright. Um, yeah, we got that corpse. Let's just head on back. Oh, okay. Okay, dog. Don't turn around. He's gonna turn around. Stop. Stop it. I'm, I'm leaving. You can just... Okay, okay. It's just a rat. Alright. Uh, yeah, we need to fill up the generator with some gas. That's first thing. We didn't manage to find any boards at all, so we can't board up any of the windows, but we can put down some bear traps. I think we'll be able to make a good number of those. Um, yeah, let's fill up at least this one. Oh, oh, not that. Fill, yeah. All right, and it shows at the bottom. Um... Should be enough to last us the night. If not, we do have flares if we really need them. And I could take some more gas out of uh, inside here. But I'm not sure how much time we have. I'm not sure if I want to waste my time doing that. I think I kind of want to get set up for the night. I think that's what I want to do with my time. Okay, so yeah, we don't have any boards of any kind. Uh, let's stick that mushroom in there. Because I know I'm going to forget that. And we have no weapon. That's actually a little more concerning. Because I think I had a weapon last time. We've just got a torch. I think maybe you could use that as a weapon. It's the best we got. Don't have it equipped, though. Yeah, equip the, uh, yeah, the bandages, whatever. Um, make another bandage. That would be nice. And, yeah, let's get some traps going. Okay, it's yeah, it's it's nighttime. We got tons of gas. We need yeah, bear trap, but we do want this on us. Uh, make another bear trap. That's a chain trap. I guess that's good enough. Yeah, actually, that's the best I can make. I can't make this until I upgrade. Okay, um, let's start setting these around. We got the entrance. Uh, where are we gonna hide out tonight? See, I don't like that the light shines out right here. That kind of spooks me here. Can I move this light? I can. Oh no, don't don't use bandages. Yeah, let's get this away from the window. And just Ah, there's another window there though. Let's let's just stick it up here and maybe hide in this co that's another window. Okay. Um Yeah, I don't like that. It I may maybe I'm giving the game too much credit that it's going to like model light going out and like people are going to be able to find me because of that. Oh, yeah, that bear trap is still there. Okay. Um I don't know. Yeah, I don't think that dog was friendly. Maybe maybe I'm just being, uh, maybe I was too quick to assume. Maybe I should have uh, given him a chance. But I'm, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna avoid the dogs and, and not, not give them a chance to be friendly or unfriendly. Um, there's no windows over here. I could stick this light over here and at least get it away from the window. Maybe I'm just wasting my time though. Because if these lights don't matter, if it doesn't matter that they're making light out the windows, then I'm just wasting time that could be spent setting traps there's still like a sliver there oh no don't move that okay oh how how did those get there 
How do... <laughs> uh, okay, we're poisoned, but that'll go away. That's fine. Okay, it's getting spoopy, though. Um, can I turn this light off, actually? Hmm, that's an idea. Although, I want it on. I just don't want it, uh... Peeking out. Can I move the bed? I can't move the bed. Is there something? Okay, well, that window is good, anyway. In fact, here we go. Let's get this set up. Right here. Yeah, I wish I had a, a window in every room of my house. It'd be sweet. I don't even have a window in this room. I got, well, okay. I have a window, but it's, it's like, it's worthless. It's not these nice, full floor to ceiling windows this dude has. Um, okay, let's, let's drag this over too. Probably should shut that door behind me. I really hope something doesn't come through while I'm moving this wardrobe. You know what, actually, if you think about it, this is, this is, uh, communist Poland, apparently. So, this guy was extremely well off. I mean, wall, like, floor-to-ceiling windows, a bed, bear traps, See, this guy was, little doilies on his wardrobes, he had it all, lamps. <laughs> I don't know much about communist Poland, but I don't know, I don't know if most people were living this well. Okay, well, uh, do I want to set up more traps? Yeah, that wardrobe doesn't look like it would actually do much. Is it blocking the light, at least? Hmm. Hmm. Don't know what that is. We're gonna... Okay. We're gonna... I wish I could rotate this, but there's not really a way to do that. Oh, good point. This might be a uh, a fellow comrade sort of situation. This this guy is in on it. In which case, it doesn't seem that impressive all of a sudden. It's like, this is all you get? I mean, I guess comparatively, very nice. Nice house in the woods. Uh, that noise is the noise from when it's daytime, isn't it? Have we already survived at night? Huh. I, th I think we've done it. Don't be anything behind the door, please. Yeah, yep. It's becoming uh, daylight right now. Well, <laughs> that went shockingly well. I guess it was pretty uneventful the first time, uh, on the first day last time, too. Um, right. I made this mistake before, and I'm not going to make this mistake again. Turn the fucking generator off. Actually, I'll bring some gas with me. Do two things at once. Fill it up. Uh, yeah, one of these full ones. Yeah, uh, <laughs> that's I could I could see myself doing that again. Just leaving the generators on all day and then oh, no lights. Luckily, we got tons of gas, so even if I did do that, it wouldn't be that bad. But yeah, switch off, and then you might as well refill. Oh, actually, we're in a uh, we're in time freeze mode right now. Oh wait, keep 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 filling. Yeah, we're in time freeze mode, so we actually got plenty of time to uh, to prepare. Shouldn't that shopkeep guy be here? Isn't that why it does time freeze? Did I did I pass right by him or something? I remember last time he spooked me because he just popped up. Yeah, there he is. Did I just miss him? Even from far, I can smell your putrid stench. Be glad I don't have an appetite for carcasses meat. Yeah, I know. I know you. Um, he can help me. Yes. Yes. Good. Go to the silent forest and meet him. Right. Um, yeah. Seen these before. Basically, he just talks about there's no road home. Stop talking about it. And he says something about liking this plastic chick, which I don't know why that's important. But gossip. I uh, wouldn't recommend wandering around these woods at night. All right. Wouldn't venture too far from here. 
Only, yep, okay. I'd avoid getting in trouble mm -hmm. until you get a decent weapon. Right, speaking of which, what do you have? What do you have available? Got a handgun frame. I still think a flashlight's a really good buy. Um, we've got tons of batteries too, so we could really get a lot of use out of that flashlight. What does a toolbox do? I mean, it's a toolbox, I have an idea, but what is a... Huh. Red egg, don't understand that one. Metal pipe, don't know if that's a weapon or if it's just, uh, just a pipe. Did I run into that before? I don't know. Okay, I think I want the flashlight. What of this do I not need? Bread. I'm never going to use bread. Uh, chain traps I want. Matches I want. Okay, let's come back. Uh, let's sell that for now. Uh, spend more time and... Yes, okay. Don't leave yet, though. We stay here. Never thought I'd be inviting a furry to stay at my house, but yes, please don't leave. Uh, we could sell gas. That's an interesting idea. We could also sell a bullet. Both of those are, are pretty valuable, though. Um, yeah, I mean, we have spare of some, some stuff that would normally be stuff we want to keep around, but we have a lot of it. Oh, yeah, let's make a lockpick while I'm thinking of it. Yeah, nice. Uh, we can definitely sell the pills, because I haven't found a use for those. We might sell this, I guess. And do we want to sell gas? We might. Sounds kind of like a strange idea, but I don't know. Um, yeah, sell the pills. We need, what, 230? I think we can do that. It'll just be a little close. Flares we don't need if we have a flashlight, honestly. Well, that's not true, because you can't have a flashlight and a weapon out at the same time. So it still could be very useful to throw a flare on the ground so that you could, so I could fight something. Although, more likely I'd just be trying to run away. Don't need a torch, though. That's, that's true. So I don't have a flashlight. Um, what else to sell? One chain trap I'm fine with selling. Kind of want to keep that bullet. I could, I don't know. If bullets are worth this much, guns must be pretty amazing. So, I think I'll keep the bullet. We need just a little bit more. This is actually... Oh, you don't buy gas. You don't want this shit. It's... <laughs> okay. I thought it was, like, very valuable, but... Alright, you don't want it. Um, okay, we're, we're very close now. Yeah, we'll sell another chain trap. One match? A couple matches? I got a bunch of matches back there, and I don't think they're really that useful. So, sure. Anything else we want to try and get out of them? If a pipe is a weapon, I, I want it extremely badly. In fact... Ah, but I wish I could check before I did it. Yeah, how did how did this furry guy how did this how did this furry end up with guns? Gun oh but they're just parts. That probably gets around the laws. I don't know Polish com communist Poland laws, but maybe uh then again I don't think they're going for realism. Let's hmm. Sell another chain trap, sell a bullet, sell a flare. It gives us seventy and we can get the pipe. Cause I wanna save the bullet if guns are uh, are good, but but a pipe would be better if I can use it as a weapon. Please tell me I can use it as a weapon. Please tell me I didn't just waste a ton of valuable stuff. Pipe. Okay. Pipe. Mm -mm. Pipe's not a weapon. Pipe is not a weapon. All right. Okay. Yep. So, got <laughs> threw away that valuable bullet, but okay, fine. I'm sure the pipes used for something important. Flashlight is definitely nice, though. Um, we'll want to keep these batteries on us. We'll want the lockpick, nails, matches, scrap, gasoline. Okay, put the gasoline back. 
I want to say that I don't need bottles on me, but I really have no idea. I could see that happening. Oh, let's make one of these. Nice. Oh, wait, that's not what I... For some reason, I thought that was making a bandage, but it was turning a bandage into a bandage with alcohol. I, d I didn't realize that that's what that was. Okay, another waste, but fine. Uh, anything else we want to do before we get out of this time freeze area? Oh, there's Wolf's Camp right down there. That's very close. I guess we've checked out most of this. Um... He wants me to meet him way over here. I don't think I really want to do that right away. I want to check this out. I like the roads being filled in. Maybe I'll check out this area. Yeah, I think so. Let's follow the road down. Watch out for that dog. 